means the number of elements in a set. For example, if a is equal to 2, 4, 6, and 8, cardinality of a denoted by this is equal to, I'll count the number of elements in a. The a is here. So inside a have 1, 2, 3, and 4. So the cardinality of a is equal to 4. Another example, if b is equal to 1, 3, and 5, the cardinality of b will be equal to 1, 2, 3, 3, since I have 3 elements in B. Between two sets. Now we consider K to be equal to 2, 4, 6, and 8, and B to be equal to 1, 2, 3, and 4. So the difference between A and B is denoted by A, B, or A minus B. So these are called difference between A and B. So to find difference between A and B, as in A minus B, will be equals to, I'll be removing B from A. So I want to remove all these things that are in A. So I'll check, is one there? No. Is two there, I will move the two. Is three there? No. Is four there, I will move the four. So what remains will be six and eight. I can also find B minus A. That is, I want to remove this A from B. So I will move this two. I will move this four. The six and the eight. So what is left will be equals to 1 and 3. Thank you. So, intersection of sets is denoted by this. So, if I write Q and I use this symbol Q, this means the intersection of P and Q. If my P is equal to 2, 4, 6, 8. And Q is equal to 1, 2, 3, and 4. The intersection are the common elements. So P intersection Q will be equal to, since 2 is here, and 2 is also here, the 2 is common between the two sets, then 2 is intersection. Then 4 also is also common. 4 is another intersection. I think we only have 2 and 4 that are common. So the intersection of P and Q are 2 and 4. So union is denoted by this. So if I write A, and I use this symbol, and I write B, I mean the union of A and B. Let's check only one example. If my A is equal to 1, 2, 3, and 4, and B is equal to 4, 5, 6, A union B will be equal to now, I want to join the two of them together. Because you know means we are joining the two of them together. So I'll copy everything in A. That is 1, 2, 3, and 4. Then I will join with B. But when you are joining them together, make sure you are not repeating element. Since 4 is already there, I don't need to write 4 again. So the next thing I think I'll write is what is 5. Then followed by 6. So this will be the intersection. The union of A and B.